Welcome to Safe to End Travel. My name is Emmy. If you're new here, subscribe to my channel so you won't miss all the killer workouts coming your way. And you can also follow me on Instagram where I post quick workouts to get you through the week. So today we're doing another 10 minutes hit workout for fat burning and full body toning. Remember that as you tone your muscles, your body will be able to burn fat and calories faster. So this time we're adding a little fun equipment that most of you have at home or even if you're traveling, you can easily buy at a convenience store or supermarket downstairs. Water bottles! You need two in total and they're an awesome substitute of dumbbells. You can actually adjust the difficulty and intensity of this workout by deciding the amount of water you want to fill up in the water bottles. The more water you have in your bottles, the heavier they are and the more difficult your workout will be. If you love heavy weights, you can also use dumbbells to replace the bottles in some of the movements. Alright, fill your bottles and let's go! So I have my two bottles completely filled with water, each holds around 770 ml. And we will start with an upper body movement, standing Arnold press. First, hold one bottle with each hand, stand up straight with your feet around shoulder width apart. Keep your elbows close to your torso and rotate the palms of your hands until they are facing forward. Keeping the upper arm still, squeeze your bicep and curl the bottles up until they are at shoulder level. Your palms should be facing towards you at this point. As you extend your arm to raise the bottles above your head, Turn your wrists at the same time so that your palms are facing forward at the highest point when your arms are almost fully extended. Then lower the bottles back down to shoulder height. Twist your palms again so that they are facing towards you and uncurl to lower the bottles back to starting position. Repeat this for 45 seconds. You should start to sweat with your arms and shoulders burning. That's normal because you're working your muscles and burning the calories. Keep at it and we'll move on to our second exercise, gaiters. Position the two bottles standing on the floor, wider than shoulder width apart. Start by jumping sideways to the right bottle, landing on your right leg at the front with a bend in the knee, bringing your left leg behind. At the same time, lean forward and touch the right water bottle with your left hand. Then switch side by reversing direction to jump to the left bottle with your left leg in front, right leg at the back and touching the left bottle with your right hand. Continue for 45 seconds. If you have done my other workouts before, you would be quite familiar with this exercise except that this time we're adding the bottles for you to use your core even more to lean forward to touch the bottles. I love skaters because they work your booty, thighs, hamstring, abs all at once and they are also great to get you out of breath and your heart pumping. That was fun, wasn't it? Rest a bit, you don't need to move the bottles, just get your mat and put it behind the bottles. We'll move on to our third exercise. We crunch rainbow. I like to give fancy names to my exercises so that I'm more motivated to do them. Sit on the mat facing the bottles, put your hands slightly behind your hips with a bend in the elbows to support your upper body. Start with having your legs between the two bottles. You're in the middle position right now. Then pull your knees in towards your body and then engage your core to turn your torso to the left and at the same time kick both legs out to the left side of the left bottle. Then suck in your abs and pull your legs in again. Then kick them out to the middle. Pull them back in again, kick them out to the right, then back to middle, and then left. You get the idea. For me, this is sort of like painting a rainbow arch with your legs and hence the name. Continue for 40 seconds and your abs should be burning. the mat aside and our fourth exercise is squat to curtsy lunge. You will only need one bottle in this exercise. First, hold onto the bottle with your left hand. Place your feet a little wider than hip width apart and we'll begin with a squat. Swing the bottle down and back in between your legs as you squat down. Then squeeze your butt as you come up and at the same time lift the bottle back up and switch to holding it with your right hand. Go straight into a curtsy lunge by stepping your left leg behind you and to the right so your thighs cross, bending both knees. Make sure your front knee is aligned with your front ankle. As you go into the curtsy lunge, swing your right hand holding the bottle to the back at the right side of your body. This is one rep. Go back into the squat as you pass the bottle back to your left hand again to repeat the same movement for 22 seconds. 
then switch side and continue with the left crazy lunges for another 22 seconds. I hope that was not too complicated, but it does need some coordination to get the right side, left side right. Don't worry, it takes some time to get used to the first few reps, but you should be fine soon after. Don't quit on me, keep going. Let's move on to our next exercise, bicep curl with tricep extension. First, hold each bottle in one hand. Go into a lunge stance with right leg in front and left leg at the back. Bend your right knee and extend your left leg as you lean your upper body to the front. Remember to keep your back straight and not arch it. Then with your palms facing forward to the front, squeeze your bicep and perform a bicep curl by lifting the bottles to your shoulders. Then still keeping your body leaning forward, swing them back down as you turn your palms in. Towards your body and perform a tricep extension by extending your arms to the back, right next to your body. Then engaging your core and back muscles, move your torso back up straight as you swing the bottles over your head with straight arms. This is one rep. Lean forward again for the next rep starting with a bicep curl. Repeat on this side for 22 seconds and then switch legs to have your left leg in front and right leg at the back. Do the same movement for another 22 seconds. Okay guys, we're halfway there. I know it's not been easy so far, but like I always say, no pain, no gain. Remember the reason you started this workout, so let's stay focused and get it done. Sixth exercise, straight leg sit up chop. You can take a little breather and lie down on the mat for this exercise. Lie on your back with your legs straight out on the floor. Hold onto one bottle with both hands and place it on top of your right shoulder next to your head. Engage your core to lift your upper body off the floor and twist your torso as you perform a chopping motion with your hands so that you touch the floor with the bottle next to your left hip. Untwist, return to starting position and repeat on this side for 22 seconds. Then switch side. Keep going guys, it's hard but I'm not giving up so you shouldn't either. Seventh exercise is another chopping exercise, lunge chop. Again, you only need one bottle. Hold onto the bottle with both hands, stand tall with your feet together. Arms up to the left side of your head, holding the bottle with a slight bend in your elbows. Then in one motion, step your right leg forward into a lunge. Twist your torso to the right and lower the bottle to your right hip. As you step back, bring the bottle back up to the starting position. Repeat for 22 seconds, then switch sides. Your arms, your shoulders, your abs, your butt, your legs are all burning, but we are almost towards the end. Push it! is thrusters. This is one of the best total body exercise to burn fat and get fit while targeting your arms, shoulders, thighs, and butt. First, grab one bottle in each hand and hold them just above your shoulders with palms facing each other. Stand with feet shoulder width apart. Then lower body down into a squat by bending knees and lowering hips down until thighs are at least parallel to the floor. Next, push yourself back up to starting position and at the same time pushing the bottle straight up above head. Arms and legs should be straight at the ending position. This completes one rep. Go back down to a squat with bottles on your shoulder and repeat for 45 seconds. We were tired, we were sweaty, but we did amazing, so give yourself a pat on the back. Two more exercises to go. Let's finish it strong. Sit back down onto your mat and we'll go on to our ninth exercise, twist and pause. You will only need one bottle. Sit on the mat with your hips and knees bent. Tighten your abs and lift your legs off the floor. Hold onto both ends of the bottle, extend your arms out, then twist your torso to the left, and then back to middle. Pause and then to the right, and then back to the middle and pause. The key here is to do the whole movement slow and controlled by engaging your core. Remember to keep your legs off the floor so that it works not only your obliques, the side of your abs and also your lower abs. However, if this is too difficult, you can have your feet on the floor to start with. Ok 
Okay guys, that was really tough on the abs. Rest a bit and we're finally on to our last exercise, which is going to be a total killer to burn the extra calories off for this workout. Jump squats. Position the two bottles standing on the floor wider than a sumo squat stance. We'll start from the right and jump all the way to the left then back to the right again and repeat. Start from some distance away from the right side of the right bottle. Jump into a squat with the right bottle in between your legs. Then jump back up to standing with your feet together as you land in between the two bottles. Jump again into a squat as you lower your body with the left bottle in between your legs. Jump back to standing as you land to the left side of your left bottle. Then jump again as you turn your body in the air to face towards the bottles. Repeat the same movement as you perform the two jump squats towards the right. Then turn again and repeat this for 45 seconds. Keep pushing, only less than 30 seconds left, you can do this. done good job you guys are absolutely killing it to make it to here thank you so much for doing another workout together with me don't forget to subscribe and follow me on instagram for all the mini workouts that i post throughout the week see you very soon